Well, 19 months ago, I was actually living with my dad, 19 months ago, uh, on a twin-size bed, uh, no headboard. It was a box spring and a mattress up against the window, one pillow. It, it, was, it, was, it was pretty funny. I look back now, and, and I'm, I'm, I'm still, just as much as I'm happy today, I was happy back then because I always had goals and visions of where it is that I was going to be. I was driving to Malibu at that time. It wasn't even mine. It was my dad's. Uh, it's, but I, you know, I, I just knew something great was going to happen. And a lot of times people would be desperate and really, you know, sad in that situation. But I never was. I always knew that something great was going to happen. And, you know, today, fast forward, I, I don't live with my dad anymore. Uh, I don't drive in Malibu. Uh, a light bulb didn't go off <laughs> initially when I first heard about it. Uh, i got to be completely honest with you. I, I really didn't think it was going to last. Um, for one, I wasn't a coffee drinker. So when uh, Mr. Holtenbugs gave me a call about it, I was not open to it at all. Uh, seven months had gone by, and I started to see and really started to pay attention to what was taking place. And then a lot of light bulbs went off. A lot of things started happening where I started to recognize that you know, coffee is pretty big right now. And uh, a lot of people are still drinking it, even though there was a recession, even though the economy wasn't going so well. People were still finding a way to get a cup of coffee every single morning. So I've always wanted to earn residual income, and I just thought, what better way to earn residual through a product that's been around for hundreds of years, uh, and then combine it with network marketing. I thought that was pretty ingenious. Nobody ever stops drinking coffee, and new coffee drinkers are being born every single day, you know, and it's, it's an acquired habit. Nobody's born a coffee drinker. So it's something that, you know, it's going to be around. Folgers start in 1850. They still seem to be doing pretty good uh, right now. You know, Maxwell House started before Folgers. Uh, you look at Starbucks, you know, and so when you look at the price of our coffee, the taste of our coffee, and the fact that it's a healthy brand of coffee, I don't think you could ever run out of people wanting coffee, and you can never run out of people wanting to be healthy. Based on your expectations of how fast you want to move with this business and how much money you want to earn from day one will determine if you want to get started at the Gold Pack or not. But the reason why I believe the Gold Pack is the best way to go is because it's setting you up for success right away. With the amount of product that you get, the amount of percentages that you can earn in the dual team and in the matching bonuses, but it also sends a message out to you and the universe that, hey, listen, I am serious about this business because I came in at the highest level possible. And the people that you're going to talk to about the opportunity, they're going to ask, what level did you come in at? And when you say gold pack, guess what? They're either going to come in at that gold pack level or the level right below it. And um, that's one of the things that I've learned, too, in 19 months. So.